Okay. Um, it's been a exciting fall with five new players and five returners. Uh, definitely had uh, some big shoes to fill uh, with the loss of uh, Susie Matzenauer and Brittany Blaylock, who advanced the NCAA tournament last year. But I've uh, been really um, pleased with the work ethic uh, and the depth of our team this fall. Um, in tournaments in Los Angeles, up at Stanford, and also at Santa Barbara, we've had uh, numerous good wins over players from nationally ranked teams. And, and I feel like all the new players are gaining a great deal of experience. Uh, and our returners have improved a lot since last season. Who are kind of like your the main people you're expecting big things from to, to carry your team now that you know Susie and Brittany are gone? They're kind of your two big guns last year. You know, I think the, the top part of the lineup, we're still figuring that out. Uh, I think the, um, this weekend's tournament um, and uh, the break over the holidays and even our first month in January, uh, we're going to use to evaluate that. Um, but uh, Alexa Lee certainly has had a very strong fall um, with uh, um, two wins over players in the national rankings. Um, Really pleased with freshman uh, Jennifer Cornia, who reached the round of 16 at the regional championships uh, after winning three matches. And uh, Margarita Spison, a transfer from Old Dominion, um, very optimistic that she's going to be able to play some great tennis for us this year as well. What are the teams that are coming this weekend? Just kind of wrap it up for us. We have uh, USF coming, um, very solid team. University of Santa Clara, a team that should be in the national rankings this year and uh, UC Santa Barbara, and you know, it always gets our blood boiling to have the Gauchos come into town. Is this a young team uh, to a large degree? Is it, is, do you have a young team to a we large do. degree? We do, we've got uh, four freshmen, um, and really all of them are in contention to start, and a sophomore transfer, um, so real young team, um, but also a team that's played a lot of junior tennis, played, uh, you know, international junior events. Um, so I think, uh, although kind of young in their years, uh, I think they're capable of playing uh, some great tennis this season.